We are getting ready for a diver hunt, layout shooting on Lake Erie. There's birds dropping from everywhere. Every time we turned around, there was another group of mallards with their wings set trying to get into that corn. We don't hunt waterfowl because we have to. We do it because we want to. We do it because that's what we love to do. Traditions always outweigh the conditions. It's in our blood with every heartbeat. It is inhaled with every breath and exhaled with every cadence of our call. It's our duty as waterfowlers to pass that tradition on. People said we couldn't make a living selling calls and decoys for cold, hard cash. But we faced the odds and took a chance. Now this business is our livelihood. Like a well-oiled machine, we have to work as a team. Day in, day out, we rely on everyone around us to make sacrifices. To make tough decisions, to strive for greatness. Sometimes, tensions rise and tempers break. But at the end of the day, we are one. We are Avian X. Avian X TV is brought to you by Browning, the best there is. Mossy Oak, it's not a passion, it's an obsession. Pattern Master, the science of shot. Go Devil. Heavy Shot, the industry leader in performance shot shell ammunition. Zinc Calls, a champion in every call. And Avian X, fuel the madness. Jojo, what do you think? It's gonna be a windy day if, if we do get out. We're calling for uh, 25 mile an hour winds. It's like every time we get together, something goes wrong. We are getting ready for a diver hunt, layout shooting on Lake Erie. Uh, we're hunting cans, redheads, and mostly bluebills actually. Uh, there should be a good mix today. Um, we're going to take a chance of getting blown off today. I'm just blowing with the 10 to 15 right now, maybe going to 20. And it's blowing south, maybe a little bit more west. So uh, we'll see how it goes. It's going to be rough though. Hunting diver ducks from Lake Erie layout boats is a hardcore hunter's game. Canvas backs, redheads, and mostly bluegills are expected action today. If weather cooperates. Sometimes we have some bad karma when we get with our good buddy Joe Robinson, and today was no different. Before we got out of the channel even, before the first layout boat was set or the, even the first decoy, Bobby had some trouble with his ignition on his motor. What happened? Ignition burned up. We just had it repaired. They put a whole brand new harness in and everything and it just went again. So if it ain't bad weather, it's, you know, I shouldn't have boat problems because we always check everything out before we go, but if I had money, I'd buy a new motor. Yeah, this is the real hunting here. You know, everybody watches them hunting videos and the deer come in in five minutes. Here we're broke down and putting all the decoys in another boat because we had a boat burn off. So. But it happens. The unexpected. Ready? Let's try this thing again. The line of diver decoys is set. 
After Sean and Jay had driven all the way from Kansas to spend three or four days in the Ohio region uh, and Michigan region hunting ducks and, and experiencing their first layout boat shoot, when it come time to get in a boat, uh, all fingers pointed to Gunner. He was a young buck and this is Gunner's first experience of hunting divers out of a layout boat. This segment has been brought to you by Browning, the best there is. When it come time to get in a boat, uh, all fingers pointed to Gunner. He was a young buck and this is Gunner's first experience of hunting divers out of a layout boat. When we were first coming out, I was pretty nervous because there was big waves and I've never been out there duck hunting. I've never been in a layout boat, so I wasn't for sure how my shooting was going to be, but I said it was pretty good. Layout boat hunting is a team effort. Each member of the Avian X crew takes their turn, set up inside the spread with ducks finishing tight to the bobbing fakes. Yep, everybody gets some action on these fast moving Lake Erie birds. Well, maybe not everyone. You know, layout shooting can be pretty daggone fun when you got the right team of guys together, unless you're sitting 30 yards behind the shooting boat. Shoulder to shoulder with another man all day long. You know, you're just watching the shooters come and go, they're shooting their birds, get in the boat, go back to the big boat, you know, they're just chilling up there, eating food, shooting the crap, taking a leak whenever they want to. They seem to forget about the weary cameraman. It's not easy to pee out of a layout boat, but after eight hours, you find a way. <sighs> the life of a cameraman. The life of a cameraman. Hardest part's getting over that drip rail. We get invited every year to go up and hunt with Dick and Bob Whitwam. Dick, also known as River Wolf in his territory up there, told me about the days of, of, of bluebills. So many bluebills that actually blackened the water. And as he would drive out in the morning, they would actually separate to let the boat go through and actually filter in behind him and close the gap. That many bluebills. Dick's in his early 70s and has been layout shooting for 40 plus years, maybe 50 years and he grew up doing it and just loved to share the experience. And even though they don't experience hundreds of thousands of, of divers in that area, there's still 15 to 25, 30,000 in that area which he hunts and still gets up every day and loves to go out and pass on that tradition of layout boat shooting. This is a two-step process. Picking your corn, feeding the deer, and getting the stocks and blend in the blind.
we're doing here. We had this blue joint that we put on earlier and blended in really, really good when we were hunting the millet and the grasses in the marsh early in the year. But now the ducks, it's cold. We're losing a lot of wood ducks. Pretty much got all mallards and they're eating their favorite thing. They're eating corn. This segment has been brought to you by Mossy Oak. It's not a passion, it's an obsession. I'd like to introduce to you the new Avian X Top Flight Mallards, created from the hands of world champion carver and lifelong waterfowl hunter, Rick Johansson. These ultra-realistic mallard decoys combine dead-on paint schemes with great paint adhesion and durability to create some of the finest mallard decoys ever made. The Avian X Top Flight series is available in two natural packs, the open water series which includes four drakes, two high heads and two low heads, and two hens, a high head and swimmer. Or the backwater series that comes with four drakes, two surface feeding drakes, two feeder drakes, and two feeding hens. All Top Flight Series decoys feature the innovative Wake Forward Swim Kill. Simply snap the line through the swim clip, which creates a natural motion to the decoy, whether in current or in the slightest of breeze. These decoys are slightly oversized and perfect for open water and marsh hunting. So why shoot those old wise mallards at 40 yards when you can have them land right in a hole? For more information on these AVNX Top Flight Mallards, check us out online at avnx.com. Anticipation builds as you walk in, slow and steady. Ducks aren't moving now and you know that. You also know there's a good chance you'll have some shooting soon. You've scouted these mallards and have them on your watch. ducks in the water and we're ducks circling at three o'clock. Usually at three o'clock there's a pretty good storm of them and then it slows down for a while and it picks back up. Yeah. All coming right from the north. That's how you do it. <laughs> Is that what he said? Yeah. That's how you do it. There you go. Put that on that strap right over there. One more. You got one more in you. You only shake twice. There you go. All right. Sit. Yeah. Oh, he yeah, and he wasn't he wasn't looking over here at all. No, you know, I put the gun no on my shoulder idea. a long time, and he never looked up, never changed what he was doing. Well, guess what?
Sean, whenever you're ready. We're out in the hole. Okay. <laughs> that was right in the hole. My gun was right here on my chest instead of in my shoulder. Gunner got in his head. Excuses, yeah. excuses. <laughs> You know that anymore? Nope. Fuck. You a little further than I thought. I got, I got up and was like, you know what? Yeah. yeah. That's about 25 or 30 yards. Good girl, Fox. I got him. I got him. To the left a little bit high, they're bowed up. Get that hole covered up, buddy. This segment has been brought to you by Pattern Master, the science of shot. I love working with puppies and young dogs, and puppies are a great addition to any hunting program. However, puppies must be fed properly right from the start. Overweight puppies are not healthy puppies. Most retriever breeds should be fed Yukonuba large breed puppy formula with controlled energy density, tailored calcium and phosphorus levels to support proper bone development and skeletal growth, and enhanced with the brain building nutrient DHA for smarter, more trainable puppies. Remember, feeding the right diet the right way will help get your puppy off to a great start. From all the members of Team Yukonuba, I'm Dr. Eric Alton, wishing you a great hunting season. Back down, load up. You're looking for that pin tail, huh?
Yeah. You on him in the hole? Yep. I tell you what, boy. Mm -hmm. Hey, as many ducks as there are coming, we're gonna shoot three or four of them, but we're gonna spook some of these up. Let's just unload it. Gonna look at that great black duck right there. As bad as it hurts, we need better off. So we were almost out of time on this hunt and we needed a few more birds and the big flocks of mallards and black ducks started coming in. We wanted to shoot our last few birds out of it. We even had drake pintails working mixed into these flocks, uh, but we knew it was smarter to just let these big flocks get back in, not bust them up, and we ended up just unloading the guns and watching big groups of ducks finish right into the decoys and get back in and get comfortable. And we were able to sneak out the back of the blind, leave them in the marsh and not disturb them. Fred and the Avian X crew made the tough decision to let the ducks keep coming, thinking ahead for the next day's hunt. Sometimes a front row seat for a scene like this is worth the price of admission. This segment's been brought to you by Zinc Calls, a champion in every call. The old duck blind blends right in by the time they see it It's a sin, shoot where they're going, not where they've been I Got twelve ducks with that green paint job Six more circling right on time I love living life with my eyes to the sky